Okay, today we want to talk about very important concept: global variable, local variable. Okay,、uh, because we've been、uh, talking about the basic vocabularies of the Python, how to use、uh, conditional looping, okay, boolean. So you can do a lot of things, and even we have done.、Uh, We have done、uh, the function, so we I see right. So what is variable? Okay, of course we know, but what is the、uh, global variable? Global variable, okay. V. We know variable, right? A name to store. The data of value、uh, versus local local variable. Okay.、Um, the idea of the global and the variable and the local is from when we write a program, started use a function. Okay. We can create. Inside the function, a kind of its own local scope, and inside the function, we can define the variable. Okay.、Uh, so if that's the case, the variable inside the function defined is we call a local variable, because other people, other、uh, other codes. Or the assignment. If we want to access to that function's variable, which is illegal, which is wrong. Okay. So this idea kind of protect. Okay, kind of to protect、uh, to misuse something、uh, which should shouldn't be used. Okay. So if you define the variable as a local,、uh, which means.、Uh, They only valid in some particular function. Okay. So usually, the local variable they have a idea to do with the inside inside the function. Okay. So what about global variable? Okay, let's suppose you ha you have write a lot of function. Okay, you may have a function one, function two. You define it, and、uh, each function have its own local local variable. But sometimes you. You the function want to access、uh, a variable which is belong to、uh, not only the, this function, maybe、uh, you put it on the globe. Okay. Outside the function, you define the function here. Okay, I use just use a black a rectangle to. Uh, to indicate a function name, not a function name, just a variable name, which is global. Okay. And this name, let's suppose, is a G. Okay, G as a global. And you want to kind of use、uh, use this G anywhere. Okay. Maybe in function one, maybe in function two, maybe in your main program. Okay, in this case, you、uh, G actually is valid for all places. Okay.、Uh, the tricky part is that this G in this case is global, but what if inside the function one there is another name? Okay, another variable. They also give a name as G. Okay.
this will make the people pretty pretty confused, right? Get people confused. So if I uh, write a code like uh, g uh, plus one, okay, here, am I going to access this g, or am I going to refer to that g? Let's start it to become the problematic, right? So here is very important concept. If you have a in, if your code is is in in the function, of course they will first finding the variable uh, belongs to the local. If they they cannot find it, they will go kind of uh, kind of look outward uh, to see the global. Okay. Uh, if there's a local fun local variable called uh, x here, uh, only valid for function one, uh, function two cannot access to this x. No, it's illegal. Uh, even the main program also cannot access to this. Okay, so kind of this x only valid for the scope inside the function one. Okay, that's the basic concept, uh, and because the Python uh, allow us to inside uh, one function, the definition of function, they have uh, another function inside it, kind of nested function. Uh, so things become a little bit more complicated, uh, but uh, it's not that difficult to learn. Uh, 